Good morning, guys. Good morning, good morning, how are you all doing? Starting off with a little espresso today. Now, today is an interesting day because, where can I, where can I put you? Six years of YouTube, five or, I don't know, five years of YouTube. Got tripods in there. Got all the gear we need, but still find it easier just to balance the camera on some chairs. Should be fine. Welcome to the vlog, how are you doing? We today are hopefully gonna make some progress on figuring out furniture and pieces that we want for the new condo. We get the keys soon. We'll update you guys when we actually get the keys. Sorry if it's noisy out here, by the way. Um, it's the aircon unit right above us. But I wanted to quickly mention some things you guys actually shared with me, uh, which was awesome. I put on my Instagram story and I said at the back end of, or the front end of one of the last videos, tell me something, comment something, something small that you do in your day that improves your life. It's a Monday for us. Is it Monday? No, it's Tuesday. Lucy and I have both in the past read books to do with motivation. They call them self-help books. It's like motivation, perspective, thinking differently. So we're both really, really into that kind of stuff. So I asked for one small thing you do that improves your life. I'm gonna share some on the vlog today while it's windy. Someone said saying three things I'm thankful for before I sleep. Meditation, making the bed daily while I mentally write a to-do list for the day. So, so many of you guys said making the bed in the mornings. That was one small thing. And I think there's like some scientific, I've heard this before. If you make your bed in the morning, it's like the first job that you can complete and it sets up the rest of the day to be productive. Are there people who don't make their bed? I've always, that's a lie. When I was a teenager, I probably didn't make my bed, but as an adult, I've always made my bed. Um, let us know if you don't, that'd be interesting as well. And why don't you? And how do you feel getting back into a messy bed at the end of the day? because I love the feeling of getting into a nice clean bed. I don't know. Someone said, have a different perspective in life, taking nothing for granted and be happy for others' successes. This is super important. It's all good and well being happy for yourself and self gain and progressing your own life, but to be happy for others, such a huge thing, such a huge thing. No jealousy, no negativity towards someone if they've got something that you haven't got. Use it as inspiration. Someone said, trying to live a more balanced life, work, meditation through painting, exercise through biking. Recently learn that meditation doesn't have to be sitting there with your eyes closed in silence you can find meditation meditation is a state of peace you can find meditation in so many different ways uh, for different people someone said take my full lunch break that puts me away from work exhaustion someone said they drink room temperature water first thing in the morning and this goes on and on if you want to follow me on Instagram oh guys guys your boy got a blue tick we're verified on Instagram that that was a big day yesterday. I did a little happy dance, but more on my Instagram and this kind of stuff. But we're gonna get on with the vlog now. I need to stand up because my feet are hurting. Need to finish my coffee. And then we'll jump in Jose. We'll go and see some furniture. We'll see Lucy. She's currently making a coffee. And we'll get on with today. Now we haven't done this for a while, have we? Good old fashioned weather check. Here you go, a little bit cloudy. What is this? It is the latest fashion piece, look. <laughs> All right. Stayed out. That's so awkward. Hang on. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Guys, it's super okay. windy. Yeah, it's so windy. Lucy just got out of the car. Can you hurry up? And her whole dress just went yes, up. So. You did, so that's great. So if you live or work in any of these buildings, then I um, can only apologise for that. Hey. <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. Okay, so it's Philippine summer. It's windy. We just came out to Home Depot? Depot? How do you say depot? I don't know, depot. Parked Jose up here. Huh? Depot. 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 Oh, I need to actually lock Jose. Uh, no! I'm carrying too much. I just dropped my shield. I'm locking the car right now. Good thing about Jose is when you lock the car, oh, you might not be able to see. The wing mirrors fold in automatically. Love that feature about this car. So, so cool. Also, do want to try and get Jose cleaned today. That is one job that I do keep putting off but need to get done. Hold on to that dress, Lucy, okay? I am. And I can't put my shield on because it just flies off into the road. Yeah, it's so, so windy. It's That's too windy to the only reason on. we're not wearing a shield because they, yeah, they, they keep, just flew off. Yeah, and it like hits into cars, so we don't want to do that. Uh, okay, wait, wait, wait. There's something coming. So, the plan today is to like look around this place. Suss it out. I mean, we're, we're gonna be moving soon, but not so soon that we need to be like in a rush. So it's actually quite nice that we're gonna have time to look around in our own pace, 
figure out the places we like and do some planning. We've done a lot of planning recently. We've picked up a few bits here and there, but today's more of like a casual figuring out where to shop. Maybe get a few bits, but obviously the bigger bits of furniture, we want to be delivered straight to the new condo instead of having to transport them ourselves. But we'll get some ideas today. We'll take some pictures. We'll, I've got my... Uh, I love this. I think I might wear it every day. <laughs> so, I love a tape measure. It's so handy. I love measuring things. So anyway, let's go. So windy. Ah. So we found some lamps on Lazada for 200 pesos, so we're going to wait for them to arrive, see if they look like they do in the pictures, and fingers crossed, we have bedside lamps already, but look how nice these are. Some really cool ones there. True. Oh, wow, should we go in? Yeah. This is actually our um, first time here because actually no we did walk around when we were looking for a sofa we didn't go in any of these shops we don't have home depot in the uk i don't know if it's like they have it in the us as well um, as the philippines but we definitely don't have this in the uk it's basically a huge warehouse essentially full of different stores and it's perfect for all like homely stuff oh there's even some cool art in here wow i actually really want some art for the new place i think for the hallway in the hallway. Yeah. Oh man, they've got some really nice stuff here, Luce. Yeah. Look at all this. By the way, I've now got my phone attached to this. Oh, it's getting it's getting worse. <laughs> Imagine by the end of the day, it's like. A whole <laughs> oh, see, I like these chairs. Well, maybe not like quite like that, but. No, I don't like them. We've got so much planning to do for this condo. It's quite stressful. It's unbelievable. <laughs> oh no, door um, handles. You guys can see how big, how vast this place is. It's quite spooky. Like we're the only people. Yeah, it's not too busy. I'm gonna figure out what wood to go in the bedroom. We already have a dark wood. This is like somewhere in the middle, I don't know. Yeah, thinking I about like something like this for a bedside table. It's kind of like Japanese-y, it's very really simple. And the price is good. It's only 1,500 pesos. And it's, it doesn't feel particularly high quality, but I don't, we don't really, it doesn't really matter. It's just to chuck your, just to put your phone on at night. And then like our new lamps that we got. That yeah. looks so nice, right? Yeah. And it's good that they're small, so it means we can have a bigger bed. <laughs> True just spotted a chair that we quite like for the living room. It's so hard just choosing random stuff though. That would that give us so far? Yeah, it would, because it's like, kind of like similar grey. Definitely it's really not, nice. not I like grey, the wood. it? Kind Definitely of. beige. <laughs> oh, thank you, she'll show you. Hey, one of the main pieces of furniture we need is a new bed, and we found one that's quite nice, but I'm gonna, I have permission to actually try this out. So um, I'm gonna lie down on it, because our bed at the moment, I don't know if I've shared this on the vlog, but my feet dangle over the edge, and, and, and so do Lucy's. Yeah, it's so, like, obviously George is a lot taller than me, even mine dangle off the edge by, like, this much, so. I'm gonna try this. Shoes off. I don't get in. I'm not getting in, I'm not getting in it. I'm just gonna <laughs> lie on it. Imagine someone just walks past now, you're just lying there. Ooh. Ah, your feet don't hang off That's the edge. Bigger. But, but lie as though you're actually gonna sleep. How would I sleep, like? I don't know how you sleep. I would sleep like that. Uh, still, feet still hang off the edge. But okay, we need a king. I think, yeah, I think we need. I think we need a king. This is a queen, but I think we do need a king. Or I somehow figure out how to become shorter. Yeah, that could work. Whichever's cheaper. <laughs> You're gonna subscribe. <laughs> Yay! Right. Found a bed here that we really like, but we think it might be a little bit too big. It's really nice. It's kind of low with these wooden legs. Down the other side. Yep. Okay, so we have then, if you imagine the whole thing from here, here to the door. Currently in a flooring store, because yes. we are considering laying some kind of, maybe something like this, something oh, it's like a, wooden star flooring. Like a, We're yeah, considering yeah. trying to lay some, they call it, it's not engineered, S. it's like a thin wooden flooring that, yeah, it's not solid wood flooring. It's one that would be very expensive. Um, and to be very expensive and that's the main reason <laughs> but we're considering laying some wood style flooring over the white tiles because when we went in the condo recently and the sun was shining it was so so bright and that floor really reflects the sun so we're thinking and also the style interior style we've got in mind is going to look nicer with the furniture we have in mind with a wooden style flooring so that's what we're considering i feel like we're on a um renovation TV show today. We are. That's we, kind of what we, this is. We pretty much are. So something annoying that happened during our furniture shop is that, I don't know where it's gone, is it in your wallet? The switch to turn this camera on and off 
fell off. So now, after, after four, five years, four years, I now have to use my fingernail to get inside the thing to actually turn it on and off. That's very four, annoying. Four years. Oh, hang on. Four, that's four years of pretty much daily use. Of daily this use, turning it on and off. It's the first thing that's gone wrong with it. So I mean, maybe it's a sign to get a new camera, or we just super glue it back on, which is probably the more likely. Oh, that sounds cheaper. Version, considering we're going to be spending some money on this furniture, but I've got this horrible light going into my eyeball. Look at that. A little, like scar from anyway we're gonna head home now we're gonna make some lunch good progress good progress i feel like we learned more about what we like we've uh, ordered a few bits we've ordered um some outdoor furniture for the balcony and we've ordered some bedside tables but we're gonna head back this weekend and um we're gonna go back to the store soon and pick it up and um, we've also made some conversations start with some flooring and we also found do we did we vlog in the shop Which that we one? really liked the yeah, Taiwanese the one, one. The, bed. the one where we were measuring the bed. The one we were measuring the bed, yeah. I really like that style of furniture. Um, so maybe we'll check out their catalogue and see because the guy from the shop emailed me the catalogue and we can see, but it is very expensive. So maybe we can be a bit smarter and find some like cheaper versions of that. But also we can always wait for Ikea to come and use Ooh. Ikea as well because um, that will hopefully be here soon. I don't know how much longer it is. Let us know in the comments if anyone's got any news on when that's meant to be finished because kind of perfect timing for us um, and that'd be cool to be able to get some Ikea stuff in there but we're getting there but as soon as the deliveries come and some, th some things arrive uh, we can show you on the vlog we can do some like hauls and things and show you what we've got so far but for now it's just going to be a case of like storing it all somewhere in our current condo before moving it over to the next so progress is being made we're getting there slowly but surely okay I've dropped Lucy back and we are getting Jose washed right now as we speak I'm staying in the car because it's super warm Jose is finally getting a well-deserved wash from these guys. Ah, oh, there is nothing like a clean car. Been putting that job off for about a week and a half. So cheap though. Don't put, yeah, it's cheap, man. It's so cheap here. Don't put your jobs off, guys. Get your jobs done. Get your jobs done. If there's something you haven't done this week that you know you need to do, just do it. Just do it. Just get out of the way, get it done. Uh, we're gonna end off this vlog here. Lucy's made a Thai curry for lunch, um, which I'm very much looking forward to indeed. So we're gonna love, love you and leave you for another day. Hope you guys are doing well. I did a little live stream on my Instagram just now. I called it a car wash Q and A, um, but Instagram cut us off. So if you were on that live stream, I answered like four questions. If you want more live streams from both of us or individually or whatever, yeah, let us know in the comment. Cause we, I don't know, I like going live. Me too. It's fun. I feel less yeah, lonely when off. I'm alive. So if you want that. Also guys, I wanted to let you know our merch. If, you, if you're new to the channel, you know I do, you might not know our do the thing message. That is on our merch. And all our merch is restocked. We've got our Philippines merch store through Merch Buy. Um, there's some other cool creators on there as well. So you can check that out. There's a link, there's a link below. There's also our international merch store. If you're watching anywhere else in the world, UK, US, Australia. I mean, we had so many people on the live stream. We had people all over the world. There's a merch store for you guys as well. If you want to support us through the merch, if you want to wear some cool do the thing branded clothing, then of course we would hugely appreciate that. And it is all back in stock. So there's one link below, but when you click that one link, it asks you where you're watching from or where you're ordering to, and you'll be redirected to the correct merch store. We had some comments saying the link doesn't work, but we've checked it and it works for us. So actually, can you guys please do a test and then just let us know that the merch link is actually working? Because for us it's working. A lot of comments recently saying the merch link doesn't work, but we've checked it. So let me know on that. We'll see you in the next vlog. Hope you guys are all doing well. Hope you have a lovely day ahead and we'll see you very, very soon in another Daily Juice.